book out about fitness, and you might be asking yourself what makes it so different. Well, the answer is the author. He's orthopedic surgeon and America's fitness doctor, Levi Harrison. And he's joining us live in our studio to tell us about his book, The Art of Fitness. We should say right off the top, you are a New Orleanian yes, as am. well. You spoke at St. Aug yesterday. Yes, I did. And we're glad to have you in our studio this morning to talk about The Art of Fitness. Tell us about this book. Well, well thank you so much. The book, The Art of Fitness, is really a phenomenal book. I believe it's the best book ever written on fitness. Mm -hmm. The goals for the book were really multiple. One, to save lives. The goal here is to decrease the rates of obesity, diabetes, cardiovascular disease, as well as hyperlipidemia, hypertriglyceridemia, hypercholesterolemia. The goal is to reach out to everybody who has a body to get the book, use the book as your personal trainer to get fit. Mm -hmm. It's not a book about bodybuilding. Okay. It's a book about building your body. It's a book about really merging your body, spirit, and mind in connection together and doing the best you can to be fit. We're all here for a great purpose. So the goal of this book was to give back to the world, to give back to humanity, to be of greater service. So think about it. The more fit you are, the more you can give back. Exactly. And the better you feel about yourself, the better you look, the better oh, you feel. Absolutely. The better your attitude. And when you talk about fitness, so much of that revolves around your diet. You absolutely. grew up here in New Orleans. Yes. Great food. Tell us about your diet growing up and why diet is so important. Well, well diet is so very important. Actually, it's one of the chapters of the book. Mm -hmm. I'll just tell you here briefly. The chapters of the book are commitment, consistency, diet, exercise, rest, and recovery. If you think about it, those five areas, if you take each of those into your life, you can do exactly what you want to do with respect to being fit and to being healthy. The goal here for the book is to weave fitness, health, and well-being mm -hmm. into the entire fabric of your life. What can you do every day to actually reach your goals? The goal here is to take small, sustainable steps to have long-term, maintained goals. Okay. And you can do it by just using the book and using the message of the book. Now, we're looking at a cover of the book. This is you on the cover here. Oh, yes. This and is. so when people follow these steps, they can look like this. Well, well I want to tell you, <laughs> I, I, that's a great question, Latanya. The, the goal of the book is for everyone to look the best that they the can. The best look. you can do. Absolutely. Yeah. So I don't, this is not the book, The Art of Levi. Uh -huh. This is The Art of Fitness, which the is applicable to everyone. So my and goal fitness here. fitness is an art. It is an art. It is an art. And it's an art form. And it's so important that everyone, they try to do what they can to actually do a little something every day mm -hmm. to be healthier and healthier. You know, I'm not asking anyone to look like me. Mm -hmm. You know, I take my body Damon? wherever you go. <laughs> <laughs> the, 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 goal I'm is, sorry, <laughs> the goal is for people to understand that you take your body wherever you go. Mm -hmm. So don't compete with anyone else. Don't go to the gym and think you have to look like you're anyone else. Right. Remember, you can exercise at home. This yeah. book is about exercising at home. What are some quick things we can do at home? Everyone's so busy. How can we fit? fitness into our busy lives? Well, that's a great question also. Let me give you five things I think that everyone should consider mm -hmm. doing. Here in America, we say chronically dehydrated. So drink more water. Mm -hmm. Eat off of a saucer instead of a large platter at night. Divide that saucer into four quadrants, one for fruits, the other for vegetables, the other for your lean meat, protein, the other for your carbohydrate, your pasta, your bread. And then, of course, you want to think about some small dairy products. The other thing they can do, of course, is exercise every day. I'm actually asking everyone to exercise one hour a day, 30 minutes in the morning, 30 minutes in the afternoon, mm -hmm. or one hour continually. It's really not that difficult. Fit it in. You, you have to do it. Mm -hmm. You know, I want people to really understand and, and really feel the importance of exercise. Exercise is really as important as air, food, and water. The fourth is exercise. We have to do it. Mm -hmm. There's no option. It and really is. we're almost out of time. You have a book signing today. Yes, I do. I have another great, I had a book signing last night at Barnes & Noble in Metairie. I have another large, massive book signing at Barnes & Noble in Baton Rouge. And later I'll be speaking at Shiloh Missionary Baptist Church. Wonderful, so. wonderful. Dr. Levi Harrison, thank you so much for stopping by. Uh, it's and great the to book, be here. The book is called The Art of Fitness. Yes. All thank right. you so much. And God bless you guys. Thanks for being